better teams all year at protecting the rim. Um, one issue has been teams making threes on us. So when we're playing well, we're defending that, and uh, we're really covering for each other. Guys flying around, you've got a pretty fully healthy roster. How nice is that from a coaching staff perspective to look down and know you've got a lot of different guys that can do a lot of different things? It's really nice. Lloyd said it to our team the other day. He said, I think this is my first practice ever where I've had 17 people all healthy uh, in practice, so it's good. It gives us a lot of different options. It gives us some versatility. Um, guys can step up if we're in foul trouble, whatever the case may be. So it's been good for us. And you know, you're pretty active during a game, changing, mixing things up. What's the, what's the kind of the halftime mindset when you go into a game? You have one plan, and then you have to make some adjustments. Yeah, hopefully we don't have to change very much. That's the hope. Um, but there's always a plan in place if we have to. Um, and so, you know, depending on what's happening in the game, if some of the best players are, you know, playing well, scoring on us. We got to get the ball out of their hands. Uh, we got to put them in a situation they don't want to be in. Those thoughts are always pre-planned, just in case we need them. There's one year ago today, the Pacers made that trade to Sacramento. Tyrese Halliburton came down. What would you say about the year that he's had? He's had an unbelievable year. I mean, the fact that he's been an All-Star, uh, the trajectory of his career in such a short time, um, the impact that he's had on our organization. He does it because of the kind of person that he is, the kind of leader that he is. He's great to be around, and then he adds all the skill to it, and it's just uh, it just makes for a great player. You remember your first meeting or interaction with him? What, did anything stand out about those early days? My first meeting at the Pacers or first meeting ever? Those are two different things. With Tyrese? Yes. Okay, well, the first one with him. So, well, t tell me both then. So I met Ty um, when he was a senior in high school. I know his high school coach. So I was uh, coaching the G League at Oshkosh and went over to his high school and watched him win a game. Uh, and I met him after that. So that's my first ever interaction with him. Uh, my first interaction with the Pacers, I just I kind of rehashed that meeting him. Uh, I think you remember it over text. Um, and then, you know, really, when, it, when, it, when a trade is made like that, you're kind of getting right down to business, trying to get him accustomed to what we do, how we do, and then how he can fit into that.